Hey, what's up you guys? This is Paul and I am showing my collection of Cracked Magazine, which was, you might say, a copy of Mad Magazine back in the day, or at least an alternative. And these are not worth much money because they're not in great condition, but these were ones from my youth, not ones that I acquired later just for the heck of it. But, uh, so what do we got here? We got September 1985... And we got Billy Idol, Michael Jackson, Boy George, and Prince. And I always thought the four of them, and and Cindy Lauper too, had real iconic '80s looks, almost cartoony, and worked well for the time. And in most cases, the talent was real too. Uh, I'm glad Billy Idol's still doing well, and I suppose so is Boy George. But um, look, he got a free hat, like Sylvester. I guess Sylvester must be the name of their mascot. I forgot that. Um, very much like Mad Magazine, they did spoof. Watch out for school children. This one's fully intact. It's just, um, you know, if you try to sell these things online, I mean, oh, what's the other, on the street, oh, they may hit you with their car. Children on the street might hit you with their car. Yeah, I think Cracked, cracked might have been a little more naughty than Mad, uh, not sure, a little more gross. Ah, probably on par. I think they're more valuable because they're more rare. They didn't sell as many. So I got that one. I got the all-improved, misspelled August 85 um, Great Monster issue. Now, I remember having these back in the earlier 80s, and I could have sworn their mascot was a, a sick-looking clown that was really scary-looking. That's what I remember. If I'm wrong about the clown or I'm thinking a different magazine, let me know. But I think the clown was earlier, and I don't have any of those issues. Cracked Monster Party. So these cracks I... Oh, November 89. These cracks I have, at least the ones that survived, are later. This one's a thick one. Super Sylvester. Yeah, they call him Sylvester. I believe my early cracked mag... 87. See, I remember having these like 79, 80, or at least 80, 81, 82. And I do... I thought I remember a twisted looking uh, clown. 87, so these, there's Rocky IV. That's always fun. I'm glad these, you know, I think I had some others that were just too beat up and I threw away. I think I kept the ones that maintained. I didn't know much about bagging and boarding stuff back then. Now, these are all, I mean, I bet I could get some, look at this. Shogun Warrior or a Transformer. More G.I. Joe. They were really going after G.I. Joe. Like a Stallone, Schwarzenegger. It's funny, Arnold, that's not really what he's known for, being buff anymore. But that back then, that was like a thing. I even did the juice when I was 25 years old because I was tired of not showing. I thought that's how you're supposed to look. And I, I, looked, I got buff enough at 22, but I didn't think it was enough because of what we were led to think was, you know, how, how you were supposed to get chicks. Um, there's something on the Hollywood Squares. Yeah, these are all 87. So I know Kraft goes much way back sooner than that. I guess my old ones didn't survive. There's 85. There's a, a Greatest. This one came with two oh, phony rec record labels that you put on your own records. That's how that was still happening in the 80s. Bonus stickers. That's one thing about Kraft. They threw in a bunch of bonuses. See how the pages folded? I mean, that's all right. But actually, these seem to be in good enough shape where I could sell these as a lot, maybe. Cold War stuff. Extra special monster party. Now, I thought I had that one. Do I have two of them? No. Different monster issue. Different year, probably. This one's 86. Too bad I don't have my, like, earlier cracked issues, but they were probably bottom. This one's pretty beat up. Um, March, not sure what year. I could have sworn I had ones from 83 and 84, but obviously I don't. This one's in bad shape. I do remember throwing away some that were just really beat up. Going after Haley's Comet, probably because it was big around that time, 86. 
A lot of Rambo. Cosby kids A team meet the A team. These cracked uh looks like they always have that inside thing. Only by products made. Let's see what it says. In America. The sign is printed in Japan. <laughs> That was a pretty fake laugh I just made, but uh, kind of funny. Free face mask. Yeah, you just <laughs> cut it and... Okay. What if I start using it now? And super cracked. Um, 86. Eh, I don't have any really old ones, do I? It's an offer. Still need to see back to the 80s. A lot of Michael Jackson stuff going on back then. Mr. T. They were very iconic. And we didn't know they were going to die young. See, it looks a lot like Mad. There's some Night, Night Rider stuff. So, see, we were making fun of um, Hasselhoff even back in the day. Great moments in aviation. This guy's got balloons and he's flying. Okay. Mario Tariano makes the first transatlantic balloon crossing. So that's correct. Yeah, man, I, well, I've already said this a few times, but I remember the earlier issues. I could have sworn they had a twisted-looking clown and um, as their guy. But that's all the cracked I got. All right, you guys. Um, thanks for watching.